You want to pop a squat, golden boy? You're making me nervous. Or perhaps your nerves need gnawing. What did I do? This precarious plan proves more meek by the moment. The Madonna was meant to be among us. She knows what she's doing. Eventually. What sorry sins I have wrought to rest me among such a motley crew. Did he? Did he take my room? Not so much as a yip from the mud. Groot says he'll keep trying. Where's Mr. Fancy Words? It is assumed Peter Quill's quarters. It was a daring display of dominance. Don't you start. Usually I'd say who needs him, but we do. So you better fix this one, Quill. Just try not to piss him off any more than he already is. If it is to be a fight to the death, I will honor the outcome. If he kills you, I get your guns. Wouldn't bet on Peter winning that fight. Took all five of us to beat him last time. I still can't believe he caught one of my smart bombs. Just like that. We have already fought the man. Hey, Quill. You seem like you're in a good mood. Huh. Do I? I've got a great idea for a new blaster extension. Can't wait to put it together. Well, now that the gang's back together and we've got a minute to breathe, I think you deserve an official thank you for what you did on Lamentis. <laughs> Quill, I, uh... I know you don't like that kind of sappy stuff, but I really mean it. Quill, you're making a mountain out of a scrap pile right now. It's embarrassing. Seriously. Mantis mentioned something about trauma. Is that where your fear of water came from? Okay, loopy girl don't know nothing about nothing. Must be from another uh, timeline. Well, regardless, you saved our lives, so thank you. The rodents saved our lives. Oh yeah, you surprised? You know, I can do more than blow stuff up. You saved our lives by blowing something up. I'll flark off, murder mom. Be right there, you impatient flark snuffle. Got you covered. Ah, got a crick in my back because of that. Glad you're back on our side, Drax. I got a feeling we'll need to go full destroyer on this one. I shall be ready, Peter Quill. I have witnessed the threat posed by Magus firsthand. No one should suffer from its malignant lies. I owe all of you a great debt of gratitude. It would be my honor to fight beside you with all of my might. That's a lot of might. Groot agrees with you, Muscles. Sounds like we've got ourselves a nice church butt-kicking party. I only hope our guest agrees to join this buttock-striking celebration. Moore, are you okay letting Mantis fight the church alone out there? She won't fight. She'll focus on evacuating people. Maybe they can all hide in the caves. So she's just gonna let the church take over her homeworld? Mantis would tell you that people matter more than the planet. And she knows that the church won't stop coming until we rescue Nikki. You have great confidence in this celestial Madonna. She's one of the few people I know I can trust. Really? She freaks me out. Because she's smarter than you? And kinder. Hey, that nickname makes my skin crawl. I'm furry, not fuzzy. Not even that little.
Hey, Warlock. Open up. This is my room, you know. And that would be my cassette cover. You pen this pithy poetry? It's not poetry, it's music. Hard rock. It's supposed to have guitars and bass and drums. Simplistic scriptures, as is its scribe. Okay, what's your deal, man? What did I do to piss you off? Your lamentable leadership allowed the Madonna to leave when we needed her talents to travel to the telepathic realm. Mantis had good reason to stay behind. We just need to get Nikki and get the hell out so we can find her again. Your tenuous tactics trust too much to fortune. Can you confidently convince me your meager measures may amply manage this mission? Yes. Absolutely. Wise words. Sure and measured. But beheld by my bemused misgivings, your demeanor differs distinctly in direction from my more willful ways. Maybe we can meet in the middle then. Yes. An oath! Will you own an oath to operate with greater aggression? To give gravitas to gravid seasons of your soul and struggle not to stand on destiny's icy flows? Sure, man. Whatever it takes. Then assert it. I swear I'll be a good leader. That'll be decisive and, and uh, that I won't let Manus do whatever she wants. I stand partially reassured. That's good enough for me. So, how is he? Frustrating. It's like talking to Suzanne Harris at the summer dance all over again. Ain't that the Humi girl you tried to impress with your yo-yo skills? Yeah, and it went about as well as... It may be up to us to stop the church in nowhere. You ready? I am Groot. He's worried about the mutt. Says it would be easier with his help. I didn't think Cosmo would let the church take over his station, but if they got the Cortex, then... He is but one canine against the army of the Converted. That explains why we ain't been able to reach Cosmo. If you don't answer it, they'll vaporize us. I will handle this communication. All yours, buddy. Hey, old traveler. Have you accepted the truth of a divine promise? We have. My deceased wife and daughter are with me. We thank the Matriarch for her gift. May the promise be fulfilled. You are clear to land on the spaceport. All them bars, and betting parlors. And noodle joints. Maybe it's not as bad as it looks? I assume it will be worse. Raker rallies regiments, while we wait whistling in the wings. Landing as fast as I can, Gold. What the flark? Great, Cocoon Boy thinks he's a butterfly now. He is a man of action. Let's just hope that he can keep the church busy while we look for Nikki. Didn't think you'd be able to bluff your way through security muscles. I am quite adept at deception. We're gonna need more than that to get to the Continuum Cortex and rescue Nikki. Especially with Golden Boy jumping ship. Should we, like, try to find him? Time is running out. 
We cannot lose focus if we are to save the girl. Drax is right. Let's just hope Warlock can do a bit of damage on his side. So, final showdown against Raker. This time, you'll get him for good. I intend to. We're not leaving here without Nikki. Ready, Drax? I am. My blades are as sharp as the rodent's tongue. Was that a metaphor? It was a simile. Your kid sure got herself in a deep quill. Her mom died, man. If Warlock's telling the truth, that thing inside her is using Corel's death to manipulate her. I get it. Ain't gonna be easy getting her out of there, but I'll die trying. I am Groot. Groot wants you to know he'll do all he can to save your kid. You know what? I think I kind of understood that. Let's do this! Time to save Nikki! Peter? Okay. Just be cool. Let me handle these guys. Welcome, travelers. Have you come to witness the fulfillment? The what now? The realization of the Matriarch's promise. The beginning of a new world. One without death, or pain, or fear. You should know this. Weren't you vetted and cleared to land here? What? Of course we were. How are you not aware of the fulfillment? Something is wrong. These heretics must be stopped! Attack! It is best to avoid the levitating pods, Peter Quill! Make them hurt, Gamora! Lock and load, Rocket! What the? Coach is choosing his team members! Guys, huddle up! Victory will soon be ours, my friends, uh, unless they send reinforcements. If they do, we'll have to move like lightning. Hit them from behind. But what if they're too fast? We'll need another plan. Hey, hey, hey! Every battle comes with some kind of curveball. But trying to predict where it's gonna land only makes things worse. Relax. It's easy to overthink when things get tense, but if we focus... We can hit him hard. Who's with me? Die, Fiend! Let's do this! Let's... Hold up, Rocket! Caution! Gamora, slice him up! Make your peace! Boom! Some down to go next! Way to take him to church, man! Better pray the new world comes without death or pain or fear, because I'm gonna kill them for flarking up this spaceport. They have been very busy redecorating. All the more reason for us to get to the Cortex and find Nikki. If the promise is to be realized here, Converted will be flocking in to witness it. Are we the only new arrivals? We must be late. Usual. There are a lot of ships patrolling. 
patrolling. Just be thankful they aren't shooting at us. Won't hear me complaining. Assuming we find the girl, how do we sever her connection with Magus? We don't. If Cocoon Boy ain't around to suck it up afterward, we'll just have to reason with her. Yeah, Quill's just doing some uh, preparation work, I guess. Well, we should prepare faster. <clears throat> Scott! Cosmos Tower's shut down! Are you good? That's because it's never been dark before. You do realize some of the guys shooting at us were nowhere security? This does not bode well for the dog. Never was the Mutt's biggest fan, but we could have used the backup telepath. If Cosmo is on their side, getting to the Cortex could be a lot harder. This mission is about saving Nikki. It'll be a real shame if Cosmo bought into the promise, but like we said in Lamentis, if we cure her, we cure everybody. What kind of promise could they offer a dog anyway? A nice game of fetch. Exactly. We just gotta have faith he's okay. Really, Peter? Faith? There's appeared to be an excess of it stored here. Kinda dreading what we're gonna see in the marketplace. The same thing we saw when we flew in. Yeah, but it'll be up close. Nowhere really stunk sometimes, but... Clark! Over there! There's so many of them. I thought most nobodies would have rejected the promise. Everyone wants something they can't have. Yeah, but... These crooks were suspicious of anyone giving them anything for free. Yeah, I don't know, Rocket. Like Gamora said, everybody wants something. The church tailors their offer to the individual. Seems to me most of them would give in. Or they'd be killed. Not an easy choice. They got Flark and Faith batteries everywhere. Just like on Hal's Hope. Perhaps they have built another giant ray gun inside the Continuum Cortex. To siphon Faith from multiple worlds at once? Is that even possible? The energy ain't filling these batteries. It's moving away from them. So they're powering something. Sure looks like it. Hey! Check it out! We got bad guys! Lousy fun flarkers! Get ready to die! They do not fear death. Don't mean we can't hurt them! Ah! Drax, up! You guys seen your boss Cosmo anywhere? Was I able to speak when under the promise? Put down another dramatic! Cut them down and let's go! All my blows are fatal! More batteries the deeper we go. Hundred units says they're tied to the fulfillment. Priest said that they were bringing. They can't raise the dead, especially after we save Nikki. I'm surprised the church was able to seize the cortex. It seemed pretty secure last time. Eh, wasn't half as secure as the dog thought. The church's forces increased. The superior numbers could have easily reached the defenses. While we got just the five of us. Filling us all with confidence there, big guy.
Wonder if any of these fortune tellers saw this coming. Unlikely. They were all charlatans. Most of them were pickpockets and fences. Pretty useful people to know. I had a contact here. Rotations ago. You did? Was it Blurf? No, no, no. Shut up and... What's? Maybe? Whoa, 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 whoa. Cat free. He always gave Groot the cream. My Groot. Uh, don't suppose we could try tricking them again? Make them believe we're all promised up. Not unless you can fake that purple glow they all seem to have. Over here! Looks like we can squeeze through. We must be close to Mantlo's bar. Can you see it? Not really. There's a lot of debris in the way. Hmm. Then I could pull that chunk out. Hey! Peter! Well, that didn't work. Larkin, I'm going in. What about the fanatics? I'll toast them if I see them. We're the only ones that can do this, right? Gamora, you should be able to get your sword in there now. Give me a boost. Look at her. This is personal, Quill. Don't leave me hanging. I've been thinking about what Warlock said. Which part? He hasn't stopped talking since we met him. About how Nikki and that Magus thing might be too intertwined to save her. Is that what he said? It's easier to understand Bug Lady. Okay, okay. Gotta make a passage here. There has been no sign of Goldie Bronze since he left from our ship. Adam Warlock. Might be splattered somewhere across the lower city. Or got picked up by a wandering creep squad. Yeah, what do we need the Golden Boy for, anyway? We were doing fine without him. I was not fine. Magus was devouring my soul. Your memory is suspect. You know why we need Warlock to stop Magus' space magic ritual? We don't know space magic! Please, yeah, please. because that ain't a real thing. Man, I'm not so sure anymore, not after Lamentis. In your eyes ahead, you must get ready. More churchies dropping in! They'll be dropping like flies soon enough! Looks like a dead end. For some more than others. Cry, Rodent. I'm not crying. I'm just remembering all the drops I did here. <clears throat> the 
They must have started the fulfillment already. Why? I just figured there'd be more converted around up here. used to be right here. Did the church destroy it? Doubt it. The Collector probably blasted out of here at the first sign of trouble. Before the first sign. The Collector's supposed to be able to see the future. Oh yeah? Never saw me coming, that's for sure. Had no idea I'd bust through that. <laughs> Hero? <laughs> Don't get all mushy on me now. Destruction is pretty massive. Guess that means some of the crooks here put up a fight. A valiant effort in the face of certain defeat. What must it feel like to have one's soul torn in two? If Magus was half my soul, I'd be happy to get rid of it. Careful, Peter Quill. Guys, look down. It's an awful lot of light. You're thinking it's the full Flarkman, ain't you? But it could just be runoff from the cables. Whatever these whack jobs are up to, they need a lot of juice. Perhaps this is how they powered their fleet to reach Lamentus. Nah, the Cortex could... Nikki had Warlock's soul stone in her hand. What if it's fused there and Raker's trying to remove it? <laughs> like he did with Goldilocks? Didn't work all that well the first time. The girl may have sensed the evil in the stone and insisted they try again. Or she's outlived her usefulness and Riker wants the stone's power for himself. Regardless, we must reach the Undercity to find the girl and stop whatever they are doing. And we'll have to be ready for them to try and stop us. Our level of cooperation is invigorating. We have become a formidable team. Yep, sure have, Drax. Ain't we just one big, happy Flarkin family? What are you doing with that garbage? She's not garbage. Behold the power of her might! Via Magnati! Not 
again! That was uh weird, Gamora. You okay? Crush him, Drax! No, it ain't my fault she's acting like this! Soft out weirdos deserve it! Throw that, Drax! I have slain the Believer! Don't be sad! Keep punking their scudding lights out! I am good! My great strength goes underutilized! What's next, Peter? Punch it, Drax! You won't ruin her this time! Keep the breathing room, uh, Groot! Girl, we might have a problem! Ah, Gamora! What's going on? You good? Never better. Yep, definitely not good. Gamora, wait, hold on a sec. Why? So more children can be sacrificed in the name of Rigor's flagged up church? No, of course not. Just. Just what, Peter? I don't know. Breathe. Every minute we waste. We don't have time to breathe. I know Raker brings back bad memories. This isn't about Thanos! It's about Nikki and what men like Raker and Thanos do to girls like her. Like me. My sister. If I had just been better at protecting Nebula, maybe... Maybe she wouldn't be dead. Whoa. What? Nebula's dead? How? By who? Tell me, so I can find him and shake his Kratakin hand. By me. You killed your sister? She is the one you saw in the Matriarch's Promise. That's how I knew it was a lie. The nebula I knew had been twisted into a hateful, vengeful monster thing. One who would never stop unless I stopped her. So I did. I just never expected to survive. Why didn't you say something? It's not exactly a conversation starter. Hi, I'm Gamora. I murdered my sister. Can we be friends? Of course we can't. How can you be friends with a monster? Why would you want that on your team? A team I actually... I kind of enjoyed being on, all things considered. Well, uh, I hate Nebula, so I actually would have... What? I'm just saying it don't change nothing. Actually, it changes everything. The most deadly woman in the galaxy just admitted... She loves us. <laughs> I did not. You did. You said you were in love with us right after the part about killing your sister. I said I enjoyed your company. That is the Katathian definition of love. Like. I I'll give you like. C can we just move on? Agreed. That's about all the love fest I can take. We accept you, Gamora Zenwubri. Pretty sure we're married now. This is excruciating. All right, I'm pretty sure we've all caught our breath. What say we go stop a nut job cult leader? Yes.
forces they can bring in here. We gotta shut it down! Let's get to the bridge. Cosmos Tower is the quickest way. Too wide to cross. Maybe we can bridge the gap. We keep saying bridge, and it's starting to sound like a made-up word. All words are made up. Groot, time to shine. I am Groot. You're the wrong guy. Drax? I have been eager to topple something over. You see that kid in the ritual thing? I could not miss him. You think the church did that to his head? Or was the poor sucker born like that? Really? A faith force field? If we can find the power source, we should be able to turn it off. Let's get looking then. Peter, let's go. We need to get out of here before Raker shows up. You know? All right, get ahead. <laughs> Guardians of the galaxy. The Matriarch has chosen to enact the fulfillment from this station. And you shall not stop her. She hasn't chosen anything. You've been manipulating her from the start! She is the light. And I am merely her servant. Kinda hard to be the light with that dark monster thingy inside of her. Blasphemy! You may have rejected her promise. But you will believe. When it returns you from death's cold clutches. Your pain has pushed you to a perilous precipice, old friend. How? It can't be. 
I saw you die. The form is fleeting, but the foundation remains forever. Now cease this stubborn senselessness before it reaps a ruinous reward. Ruinous. Oops. Me and Groot, we win this in our sleep. Thanos sees a timing in fights like this just to make it interesting. They are no match for these blades, Peter Quill. All right, all right, listen. This isn't our first rodeo, guys. Problem is, if we play a cocky, one little mistake is going to bring us down. So let's get back out there, give this fight complete dedication, and make them scream. Who's with me? I am with you, Peter Quill. Ah! On the left! Marcus Snipers! Fast cowards! We need to close this distance! That priest is pumping faith into the others! Well, that's not fair! Foul magic! The sorcerer's What's weapon the is under a feel? Let's do Beware. that to him! Put him down hard! <laughs> gotta get on flat face! He's mending his friends! Well, that's not fair! This'll work! We can leapfrog our way back onto the bridge! Leapfrog? It's a... Just follow my lead! Take down the fire! He's healing the rest! What are you waiting for? Shoot him in the face! This has got my name on Love it! Love it at him, big guy! Watch it! He's healing his buddies! He can't do that without a head! We approach the dog's tower! Hold on, Nikki! We're coming! Ice to the bone! Crap! Now it's Nova! They're gonna need a huge recruitment drive after this! Blue! Golden Boy and Uni Parker are still at it! Hook all the god stuff wasn't just talk! We're sitting ducks! You are wrong on both counts! He means we can't stay here! On this we are agreed! Collapse this! You tell tale of our battles here! Is that like a Katastian minstrel? <laughs> Knife to meet you! <laughs> Make sure you don't fall off! Rex, toss Make it! Make sure those snipers don't hit you either! Cut him off, Gamora! Incoming! Okay! We gotta get to that elevator! Too bad they busted us the red! Busted open the Nova Core track now. Ready. Ready. Knock some sense into him. Crap! Now it's Nova. They're not Nova anymore, Peter. What is next, Peter Quill? Just once, I'd like to cross this bridge without incident. You can thank Goldie for that. The Warlock saved us from certain death. Uh, I ain't scared of Riker in his little light show. Her yeah. justice is swift. What's next, Peter? Of course it was easier to get to before. When I get near, the Centurion! 
Barbarian flies away! We need to take him in for a forced landing! So I guess Goldie survived that jump! Can you see Raker's face when he's going up? Make sure you don't fall off! I got jet boots, remember? We approach the dog's tower! Hold on, Nikki! We're coming! My great strength goes underutilized! Ooh. Danger close, Rocket! Okay! We gotta get to that elevator! Gonna have to use the rooftop! Hey, we don't need Golden Boy's help! Is that why you shot him? <laughs> oh yeah! That was great! Right in the butt! Did you see the look on his face? It was all like, oh my gilded glutes! Regal rare! Look out! Finally, I think they're giving up. Just in time, because we're not getting back on that bridge. I know where we are. There's a road nearby that intersects the main bridge to Cosmos. Where? It should be, uh, right below us. Drax, buddy, let's make a hole. That's one way down. The best way.
Groot. Uh, Groot thinks we'll be nowhere royalty once we save it. Assuming they don't blame us for the Grand Unicorn. And the brainwashing cult. Look! They're still at it! At least our guy seems to be winning. This carnage brings back troubling memories of worlds I destroyed. Always wondered, what did you use to do that? Some kind of mega bombs? Rocket! Blades. My own hands. And feet. Ba 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 boom, baby! You sure are destroying a lot of advertising today. Like we need another reminder to buy Calex cream. Be flarking kidding me. Perhaps we should summon the ship to deliver us to our destination. Ain't no way they'd let us land anywhere near the big party. Don't suppose Groot knows another side route. If I could just get to the other side, I could hack that thing and drop the bridge. If you can get to the other side, we can get to the other side, and it wouldn't matter. <sighs> Throw me. What? Throw me! Just get muscles to huck me across. Are you kidding? After the fit you threw last time? The same like the last time. You all... I trust you guys. Leave this to me! Whoa! Glad that wasn't rocket! You are a valued member of this team. Not a tool to be thrown about. Worried about this ritual. And what's really gonna happen if we can't stop it? Ain't gonna be dead people coming back, holding hands and wagging tails, that's for sure. We won't have to worry about that. I know I can get through to Nikki. This is Raker's doing, not hers. I won't give up on her either. Nor will I. Yeah, and neither will the Grand Unicorn. He will regret it. How dumb are these Flartnards to even fall for this full Flarkman garbage? Magus demands adulation, trapping you with vile illusion while feeding on your soul. I felt it in my promise too. That endless hunger. Holy faith! All that light isn't leading to the Cortex. It is the Cortex. How could that mutt let this happen? Looks like you'll get to ask him yourself. This isn't the man, but... Cosmo! We've got to get down there! Don't count him out just yet. I've seen him get out of worse scrapes. The beast is being exposed, I promise! Get away from my dog! <clears throat> I guess this means there's no nowhere resistance! 
We're the resistance now! Having fun preying on the weak? What are you doing? He's one of them now. He's our friend. Yeah, so is Drax. And I ain't going inside this flea bag's head. Maybe it doesn't have to come to that. Hey, buddy. Are you, uh. <laughs> <laughs> Before it's too late. Wait! He's still in there. I can hear him. I hear only barking. Focus your mind. He's there. Ah, uh, oh, Farka, just shoot the mutt! No! <sighs> Easy, bud. Friends, remember? He's Pyotr Kuhn. Kozlo knows never lie. Yeah, buddy. It's me. It's all of us. Where is Cosmo smell? Smell of nowhere. Where else would we be, fur brain? His mind is addled. Or he is simply a dog. He doesn't see us. He's still in the promise. Cosmo, where are you? What do you see? Blue sky. In cars to chase. Cosmo is big. Duma. How you say? Home. He's talking about Earth. Smell of fresh grass. Feeling of dirt between paws. No psychic burden. Just walkies for going. And the ball for fetching. If you missed your home planet, could you not simply return at any time? Not at time that matter. Same reason Katathian, not go home. Nowhere is your home. Right here and now. Nowhere is nothing. Dead heads, mind for scrap. It's way more than that. 